what's up y'all and welcome to another episode of Upstart Livewire. This is Aurora Central High School. This is where I spent a majority of my high school career. And even though I didn't appreciate it back then, I made a lot of good memories at this school. Fast forward two decades later, and my son Tristan is a proud member of the graduating class of 2020 from Aurora Central High School. Now to my son Tristan, I would like to say it has been a great honor and a great pleasure raising you and watching you become the man that you have become. I've seen you struggle, I've seen you work hard, I've watched you through the late nights of doing your homework and catching up with everything. I've seen you put your mind to doing something and doing it, you know, not just saying I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that, but I've seen you do it. You, you ran track, you played football, you were an outstanding member of Aurora Central's ROTC squad. You are the beginning of a very successful story, and I simply couldn't be prouder. Now, to the rest of the class of 2020, whether you're here in Colorado or somewhere spread out throughout this great country, I say congratulations. Um, 2020, we're only about five months in, and 2020 has been rough on everybody, particularly rough on you. You know, just the world crashed when it was supposed to be the time of your life. But don't be discouraged. Take heart. You know, uh, every graduating ceremony, they talk about going out and making history and doing all these amazing things. You all have made history. You all are living, breathing testaments to history. What's going on now in 2020 is something that they're going to make movies about, write books about. It, it's part of our history. And the amazing thing is some of you out there are going to make those movies are going to write those books so just, you're, just keep in mind forever you are not forgotten you are not necessarily the class of the quarantine you are a class that is a part of history from here on out and you should you, you should stand up and salute yourself so to the class of 2020 I say congratulations, and uh, here's to seeing what amazing things you do with tomorrow.